Hey, what's up, guys? Warlocks, we're back here, and today my music is, is slowly setting up. <laughs> no, but um, today we are playing a modified version of Free Shaman. Um, honestly, Free Shaman to me seems like a really, really fun deck to play. Don't get me wrong. I actually really like it's one of the few competitive decks in the game that I actually really enjoy right now. Um, in my opinion, it's just a cool deck. Although I wanted to meme a little bit. You know, you know me. I like memeing. I like not necessarily playing the best version of all the decks. I like playing the versions that just fuck around and do hilarious shit. So that's exactly what I have here. Um, basically, I was like, look, Freeze Shaman is really good, right? You freeze shit and you kill them with huge ass fucking uh, Snowfall Guardians or Brilliant Macaws. But to me, I was thinking like, that's great and all. But what happens if you're playing against, you know, a priest that has like death, right? They can have theoretically four deaths. So that's one, two, uh, three, four, right? So then obviously you have Shutterwalk as your fifth one, but what happens then if he has, I don't know, mind control? Like, you know, it's, it's irrealistic, but he could always have mind control. So, your boy, thinking ahead, but corrupt the fucking waters. First of all, double triggers on Brilliant Macaw. Double triggers on, uh, you know, Lotheb, Grumble. I, I guess Grumble is less important. Snowfall Guardian, right? I just think it's really good, but then also it gives you the opportunity to potentially go combo Shutterwalk and then just you know, if you land the first Shutterwalk, you're chilling, right? Next thing you can go corrupt the waters, um, and then play Shutterwalk, and you're guaranteed to bounce a Shutterwalk back to your hand. Also, at the same time, I mean, you can do the same thing with Brilliant Macaw. So you kind of have, like, I guess, three Shutterwalks in your deck. And the thing is, right, you can go Shutterwalk, and the next thing you can go corrupt the waters, uh, Brilliant Macaw, you can still have the same effect, because you'd be doing the Shutterwalks battle cry. Um... With that being said, also, the, I added Boom Pistol Bully. I don't think there's that many Battle Cry minions currently in the game, but I think it's good enough to slow down other free shamans just enough in order to be able to land the first Snowfall Guardian. I believe you want to be landing the first one. Is it first or second? I never remember, but basically one person wants to land it first, and I believe that's you. I could be wrong there, but I believe it's you. Anyways, though, whatever. With that being said... Also, obviously, you're still playing this guy because you don't want to have your shit frozen. Also, it cucks them right up there. Like, okay, I'll Snowfall Guardian, I'll survive. And then you can just slam this. It defreezes your minions and you kill them, if I'm not mistaken. Pretty sure that's how that works, but I have not played enough with it to actually know. But I'm pretty sure I saw that working like that in Arena, at least back in the day. Anyway, so with that being said, grab a drink and let's hop right into the first game. All right, guys? I'll see y'all there. Ah, all right. A fellow memer. I mean, I don't know if he's necessarily memeing, but... You know, a fellow. But the difference is, we have corrupt the waters. That also means, like, you know, just small things like double dungeoneer, which is, like, a really fucking good. Also, I mean, you replace your shitty hero power. If we're being honest, okay, if we want to be honest, the hero power um, that Shaman has is. It used to be one of the best ones, in my opinion. The spell damage to him was really, really good. I mean, yes, now, I guess, the plus one attack one is also pretty solid in the late game. Uh, but at the same time, I mean, you know, it's not nearly as good as a combo finisher with the spell damage one. Also, it kind of gets killed spell damage shaman, which kind of sucks, but, eh. At least we kind of have a similar deck that plays the new guy. Uh, alright. Have you just coin? Fuck, that's not what I wanted to see. That route right there, that was not an ideal pull, uh, if I'm being honest. If you build, a, if you would have built a one three, it would have been arguably. I am so fucking mad, man. What in the actual fuck is this? How is it that he? Okay. Hate this game. I actually fucking hate this game. Healing. So just do this. Okay. Well. Obviously, that was not fucking ideal. He's gonna pull the Firemancer Flurg. At least I called it. Can I draw Toxfin? Oh, that's actually also pretty fucking nice. I'm being honest. This combo's together, right? Which is pretty dope. Still no healing, which fucking blows, but what can you do? Alright. I can now hear the game sounds again. <laughs> I did not have my headphones on, so now I, now I can hear it now. Hmm. 
for those who are wondering, you know how I always like to say what I am currently drinking while doing a recording. I hate this fucking game. I fucking hate this game. For fuck's sake, man. This Lothar is... Oh. I might as well get value now. Right? It's not like this game is still fucking winnable. I, I say that. That's not exactly true. This game can still very realistically be won. It's just gonna be hard as shit. Bog you? You know, it doesn't really do much here, but. Is there anything I don't want back? I want this back. Alright, I'm fine with this. I have another board wipe now from hand for two. Um. I complete quest, which is fairly nice. Hmm, if I draw a free spell here, I'm in a really, really good position. This way it can be this, this, and then I have upgraded hero power, so I can wait for the upgraded hero power to do this. Or, I mean, do I want to just take the damage? It's so much harder to win now, is the problem. I can just burn it now. I mean, it's not the end of the world, right? Fuck it. It upgrades my hero power so much that I think this is worth it. Right, this hero power is just your battle cry is triggered twice this turn, yeah. It's just brand. And that's 20 health. This is actually a fairly early complete. If he didn't pull both of my Serenite Chain Gangs, I would actually have a chance here. Of course. Boom Pistol's pretty nice. Get. Fucked. I actually get fucked. I mean, the problem is he still played Serenite. That's the general problem I have right now. Hmm. Okay. I feel like I can beat this, right? Okay, so I want to get rid of as much of my board here as possible. That's fine. Five, six, seven. Burns Flurg for this. So, I don't want to get another 10. If I play this, he for sure slams it. I'm better off just waiting, I think. Yeah. Right now, we're looking for Primal Engineer. We're looking for. Actually, I mean, Primal Engineer is not even that great here. We're looking for Zen Timo. Zen Timo right here is like super fucking good. Draws me three cards. If I slam this, I the next card I can play is Brilliant Macaw. Even then, I mean, do I even win? No, I don't have... Uh, this is so problematic. I think I still just do slam this. Hmm. Yeah, I can slam this, that's fine. Take that trade. All right, I have a brilliant macaw now. If I draw the other one, I can go infinite, right? It's still so fucking annoying that he pulled both of my chain gangs, man. If I if he hadn't pulled both of my chain gangs, I'd won this game. Straight up, this game was won. Finally. Well. 
what does this do? It gives me four wind chills. Not good enough, is it? Should have done that in the opposite order. Not only would have this gotten slightly bigger, but Jeweled Macaw would have been of a bless there. Oh my fucking god. I fucking hate this game. Can I go draw another Snowfall Guardian, please? I'll grab both the last spells in my deck. I want a new grip anyways. Uh, now I should wait till next turn. This draws me nothing. There's no more spells left in my deck. Oh, this is so annoying. Man, I had won this game. He hadn't pulled both of my Serenite Chain Gangs. This game was actually won. I would have won this game. I would currently... He would be dead. There we go. That's such a good card to draw here. This. Let's do this. There's no one drops in my deck. No, there's not. Okay. That's fine. just slam this here i think it's worth that deck should have no other murlocs in it and he's played his devolve i doubt he's playing two that just straight up doesn't make sense in the current meta in my opinion you're like not devolving anything that's actually scary and if he does i still have brilliant macaw number two it sucks that i had to send shutter walk would be ginormous here. He's probably hoping for a snowfall guardian, but I cut that idea. Cut it right out of the fucking ground. I fucking hate this game. This game has not been going in my favor at all in the last fucking three days. Oh, is this work how I want it to work? Fucking cock. That was the one minute I didn't want him to be able to play. It's okay. Like, it's the one minute I didn't want him to eat. To be fair, I won the game here. He's one mana off doing what he was hoping to be able to nuke my board afterwards. dead but i was summoned this he couldn't play the rest of his hand get fucking get out of my game that's what you get for pulling both of my scenario chain gangs in turn two or turn three or whatever the fuck it was he had double dirty rat in his opener like come on game anyways though, that was a good fucking first game though i'm 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 glad we won that one anyways, though, let's keep the next one and let's see how this let's let's hope this continues to go well okay druid I think this is a little hard. I'm assuming it's combo, right? Oh, that's a good one. I'm okay with this. Okay, I'm I'm like extremely okay with this hand. These might sh these maybe should be cut, but they're like the best draw spell I can realistically play. There's like I guess Sandbinder, but Sandbinder is not nearly as good, in my humble opinion. Um, the reason I don't think Sandbinder is as good, um, just because, like, it, it's more mana is, like, the first thing. I guess it's slightly better stats, but it's also a 4-drop. I was even debating adding the combo because of how good the deck is, uh, with Kazakus. I really enjoy playing Kazakus in this deck. 
with shutter walk uh it goes a, it's a little bit awkward when you're actually adding cards to your hand like it's already awkward enough with the uh, these right because you, know, you don't necessarily know if you're gonna hit you play them all and it's it's a little bit more risque if you know what i'm saying i'm gonna take a wind chill here that's fine that is fine That was fine. Oh, let the chain gang low, let it wobble, let it low. Am I gonna get DMCA for that? Uh, I hope that's not DMCA. -able. I don't even know that song is considered D. What the fuck is this thing? Your next choose one card costs two less. Oh, it doesn't say this turn. That's actually kind of dope. He's giving me so much manas. Might cost two less. No, I want to prevent him from actually from just playing a spell. Do this into this, which just prevents him from playing a spell. Is that fine? No, I'd rather just straight slam this. Oh, I should have drawn first. Ooh, Zentimo. It's also, I assume it's still a combo deck, even if it's like this. But I, I don't know. Oh, sorry if you hear people talking. I think my mom just got home. Um, can't realistically play a spell, right? Oh, we can play that. Now his spells only cost one more. Or I guess no more at this point. Oh. Okay. Finally actually squeezing damage in. Do I go send Tima to draw two here? Yeah, that's fine. Because if I hit Shutterwalk combo, I just win the game, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. If I, the, if I hit Shutterwalk, also, like, all these cost more, so it's a little bit even more awkward. He only has three cards that are base amount. And I guess unless it's choose one, in which case it costs three less. But, hey. I also don't know how good Watch Post is right now. This card might be bad. In the deck. I mean, right now that he can't answer, it's like really fucking good. Behind taunts, it's a little bit harder for Drew to answer. Because a lot of them cut cards like naturalize and things like that. So, you know. I'm also thinking possibly it might be correct to put one, like, the deal damage card. So when you're going infinite, you actually go infinite, infinite. That's fine. What choose one card is that? What card could it be? What card could it be? To be fair, any card he draws, he can't play. Oh, that's a really good choose one card, huh? Oh, he's gonna be sad. He can't play any of those cards next turn. Oh, that's a good one. I'm, I'm just gonna go face. Like, there's nothing else I could realistically do. If I play this, I just wipe my board. He can't play any of these cards. These ones he's able to play. He can play the other one. Uh, I guess now he can play them. Oh well. I'm just dead. I'm pretty sure I'm just dead here. That's a cool bug. Oh my god, he actually just hit all the ran. Can I beat that card? I need to have both of these, then I won the game. Okay. Hmm. How the fuck do I beat this? just can't and okay, now I can this one's card I wanted to see
Alright, well. He can't play any more minions. Which means he can't kill me in that way. He. has to kill me through a spell. If I draw Shutterwalk here, I win the game. If he wipes my board. Yeah, that's, that's just a thing. Should not have dealt there. Oh, it doesn't matter. He's gonna trade off those. Oh, I'm dead to Malagos. That's about it, though. Shut the fuck up. I should have possibly slammed the watch post, but he could have traded into it in that case. Both solar eclipses out of the way. Oh, is it Mechathun? Is it actually Mechathun? There's another deck that ramps that hard, right? Yeah, okay, I'm just dead to Mechathun. Interesting. We don't have any more card drafts. We are really lucky there. Hmm. Okay, fuck me. Uh, Alright, let's keep the next one. Alright, our next matchup is against Cancer. <laughs> uh, I hate this deck. <laughs> I hate the deck we're playing against. In my opinion, it's the worst one to play against, but hey. What's the wrong guy? Actually, I mean, I can play that on 5 if he completes quest on 4, trying to still dig for a rat, and I can slam it. But watch post typically delays him a turn, I believe. I mean, it's still... If he doesn't play Guy on the same turn, he completes quest, I'm chilling. This might have been a matchup, though. I should have actually mauled quest. Because it's slightly worse, I believe, than other things. But hey. Okay. <sighs> hmm. It'd be great though if he was here to actually play the fucking game. To be fair, if it's not Questline Hunter, we're chilling. The odds of it not being Questline Hunter, 0%. Like, it's actually close to 0%. Yep, odd Questline Hunter. Very original. Pog you? That's a pog you right there. Right there, right there. I love, I love Dirty Rat. Dirty Rat is such a fun card to play, in my opinion. One of the most fun cards to play, actually. I mean, this is going to just discount one card, but I mean, I'm fine with that. I'm really fine with it just being single card value. Are you going to end your turn, or are you going to just rope because you're not good enough to actually win the game? You have to just play a broken deck. In this matchup, I guess Toxfin Flurg is still really good. I have yet to be able to draw both off Ice Fishing. It always happens when I'm the one on the other side, but no, no, you know. What the fuck is that? Haunt? No. Actually, though, what the fuck is that? Why is that in his deck? I'll never know. 
At least I have a double rat game. This is a double rat gamer. There's gonna be triple rat gamer. How long can this go on? This is this hand is a triple rat gamer. That's that's pretty solid. Sure. I'm okay. It's fine. It's fine. Not tilted. Not tilted copium. I'm playing this just so I have something on board. If it saves me four health, it saves me four health. If it doesn't, it doesn't. It's 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 whatever. Oh, this is this is not where I want to be. I want Lotheb. Then I want Grumble. Then I want Shutterwalk on Curve. With Battlecry's in between. I just want to draw Flurry actually right now. I would be in a really good position if I had drawn Flurg. Just rapid fire, rapid fire. Uh, can he play two spells next turn and still... I don't think so. Hmm. My draw was so bad this game, it's actually insane. I've drawn zero cards that actually do anything. And I'm not playing Devolve, so I can't even get rid of that 3-4. It's very depression. I'm gonna lose just because I can't actually do anything. My hand is so shit right now, I just... Unless I draw exactly Firemancer Flurg, I can't win the game. If I do, though, I win the game. It's not Firemancer Flurg. Okay. Well. I mean, this is just going to die to spells, because that's Quest Hunter, and that deck is degenerate, but... Uh, I need to find... A second snowbird or snowblind harpy. I have to find the second one. Kill command. Hero power. Yep. His version of this deck is fucking awful, and it doesn't matter. He's just playing the best cards in the game, and he had an optimal curve with mini mage on two. Well, he's playing so many minions in his deck that the odds of this actually hitting are so fucking low. I hate this game. Nope, not good enough. Uh, whenever I queue into Quest Hunter, I actually just don't want to play the game anymore. It's typically when I say that's enough's enough. I played against you once, you've done your dumb shit that should no longer be in the game, and then I'm done. We can, uh, we'll move on to a different game. I'm gonna open a pack and then I'm done. That deck tilts me more than I think most things do. It's probably why Storm tilts me so much in EDH, or in Magic in general. Storm feels just as interactable and just as broken to me as Quest Hunter. I might be wrong. I know if my brother's watching this, he's gonna get mad at me for saying that. Oh, Pog you? You know what, that makes me feel better. Oh, transform into six... Let's turn into a 6-6 six, six copy of a demon in your deck. That's actually not even too bad. I kind of want to try playing Demon Hunter, like a big Demon Hunter deck. Just as I generally like playing 
weirder decks like that, but we're one card away. Do we? Do we do it? Kind of want to do it. I kind of want to do it. You know what? Hmm. You know what? I'm very tempted to just do it. Do I just say fuck it, do it? Do I just craft Rakara? I'd have to find a deck to play Rakara in. I don't quite know what she does. So... If I can find a deck for tomorrow's video where I would play Rakara in, I'll craft Rakara. This way we'll complete all those, which is kind of dope. I got another one of those two. Let's, let's see her cooler. What's the new rogue card I have? Oh, there it was. It was a Yeti. Warlock is... I should just click on new, huh? This is the least efficient way of doing this. This is kind of toxic. Oh, what the fuck is this to do? Cast the highest cost fill spell in your hand. Uh, that's... That's actually not the worst. You'll see how many cards I'm missing from older sets. Honorable kill, draw a weapon. That's not good. Why would you play that when your quest draws a weapon for you? She's a... Uh, how much mana? She's six. Unstoppable force. I don't know what that does. Two damage, honorable kill. What does the unstoppable force? Un... Stop Hubble Force Hearthstone. Sorry if my keyboard is fucking loud. I've been thinking about getting a new one that's a little bit quieter, but hey. Unstoppable Force. After you attack a minion, smash it into the enemy hero. That's really cool, actually. Okay, we might craft our car. I, I have ideas with this. But a deck that I really enjoy playing. I think it. I think our car would be good in it. But hey, we'll see. Anyways, though, with all that being said, I hope y'all enjoyed the video. If you guys did, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe. I don't know if this is going to be a shorter one or a longer one. But I did take a break in between, so, you know. Uh, hopefully, it's it's a good one, though. <laughs> Anyways, though, whatever. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe. As always, follow me on Twitch and Twitter, as always. And uh, I'll see you guys all in the next one. All right, guys? Peace.